I have a mustache. <laughs> I get tons of questions about Linux and you guys are awesome at asking for advice and giving me feedback on things. The most common comment I get is, sudo make me a sandwich. The second most common question I get asked is, how the heck do I record my desktop in Linux? Now, whether you want to show somebody your high score on Pingus or capture that cool moment online, I can help you do that the both easy and the difficult way. So stay tuned for the tutorial. The easiest way to get what you need to record your desktop is to go to Applications in Ubuntu Software Center. And then go ahead and type Screencast, where we'll just install GTK Record My Desktop. After the installation finishes, head on over to Applications, Sound and Video, and then GTK Record My Desktop. This is Record My Desktop. Now, it's a bare-bones recording program that has very few options, but by the same token, since it's so basic, you can learn it instantly, and I will show you how to record now. We're now recording in recording. Do, 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 do. Since Record My Desktop has no other supported video formats, it's limited to saving the recorded files in the open source AUG format, which it's hard to edit in along with people having reported that the program itself is buggy altogether. We can do better. Though this way is both lightning fast and easy, as with many graphical user interfaces, GUI, it's just not as versatile as using the terminal would be. So here is the difficult way. Glad you accepted the challenge. Now to save us some time, I'm going to direct you to the amazing guide put together by Fake Outdoorsman. So we're on the Ubuntu forums now, and we're going to search for install FFmpeg x264. After the search is done, we have the instructions on how to download and compile FFmpeg from the latest source. Now don't be scared. I know the guide looks daunting, but it's actually the most thorough and complete guide that you could get as far as getting the most up-to-date information on FFmpeg, along with all the video file formats you could hope for. Now that you have the most current version of FFmpeg, let's check all the formats we can use to record by typing FFmpeg-formats. Now for my favorite part. I don't have compiz on here, so I opened up a document so you can read the command clearly. When you're in the terminal, you will type it as a single command without pressing enter. FFmpeg is the program name, dash R is the frame rate we want, and 30 is pretty good. Dash S is the resolution. Dash FX11 grab is the function we'll use to grab the desktop. And dash I is the display screen number of your X11 server. So unless you know otherwise, just use 0, .0. Dash V codec is whatever video codec you want and refer back to the formats I showed you. And dash Q scale is a quantizer scale where you're using numbers 1 through 30 for quality and size. 1 being the highest quality, biggest size, and 30 being the lowest quality and lowest size. And then you put your file name along with the container that you want it in. And you'll know that your code works because it'll look something like this. And don't bother yourself with if it says it's clipping or not. Just make sure to press Q to stop recording. Thanks for stopping by. Now I'm going to launch a brand new segment about the complicated issues in Ubuntu and their easy solutions. So don't forget about me and check back soon.